Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm gonna to do a comparison between these two Dynamo label makers. So on the right here, I've got this one that you're gonna turn and you're gonna press. So let's say I want, let's spell out just. You gotta find it and put the letter there that you want. And then you're gonna pull this trigger. That's going to stamp it onto the label and it kind of gives it kind of a 3D effect that's raised. And then you gotta turn this to the next letter, again, press real hard, and then S, and then T. And then when you want it to come out, you gotta go, there's a cut icon. Go all the way over to cut icon and kind of halfway press it, press it. Okay, so the first one didn't come out really well, I had to redo it, now just halfway press it, it kind of gives it some space. And then when you want to cut it, press it real hard, and now you've got it cut. There's just, gives you a little tab here to pull off, and then you can stick this to different things. Here's some labels I printed earlier. So you can see it sticks right there. Now let's go to this label maker. This is a really nice label maker. It is battery powered. You gotta put four AA batteries in. This is where the tape goes up here. You got different types of tape. This is white on plastic. Let's turn it on. You're gonna spell out your letters like I've got here. This is the backspace, then type in like D, hit print. It prints it for you, then it's gonna, we're gonna still have to cut it with this cutter right here. Hit, press the cut, here we go. There's our label, it's real thin. It's, you know, it's like a piece of paper. We're gonna peel the back off, that exposes the sticky part. And now we can stick this to different things. Let's stick it down here, it sticks really well. It's really flat. Again, you'll see this one is kind of raised just ever so slightly. Gives it kind of a 3D effect. So with this one, I've got several more characters. I can adjust the size. I can go bold. I can add characters. You know, this one, you are just a little bit limited. I can add a few things, but each thing is manually and I got to turn it. But this is just really nice. Doesn't require batteries. To change the reel, you're gonna pull this back and that's where the tape goes. So you're gonna put the tape in there like that. Like here's a new one here. And then you're gonna you're gonna feed it up through there and then you're ready to go. So I hope this comparison video helped. Thanks everybody for watching.